Você tá bem? Você bateu a cabeça com tudo. Meu Deus, você tá vendo isso? Tô. Eu tô... Incrível! I know you said before that when you're growing up, you wish you had a movie like this. Yeah. Right? Uh, so how was Amy Schumer teenager and what impact would this movie have had on her? Okay, so when I was a teenager, um, I... Like I, like everyone else, I was very awkward and uncomfortable. I also had pretty thick bangs, mm -hmm. um, and bangs don't work on everyone. And I am one of those people. <laughs> I know that. Yeah, I know. I like my hair is curly, so they would frizz up, and um, I. But I, I didn't care. Mm -hmm. You know, I was flawed as hell, but I didn't care. I felt really good about myself as a teenager. Mm -hmm. uh, I felt pretty bad about myself before I was a teenager mm -hmm. and then right after, but teenage years weren't that bad. Great. Do you have any uh, advice to like a young women, woman who's struggling with her confidence and self-esteem right Absolutely. now? Absolutely. Well, first of all, I would love for them to see this movie because I really think that will make them feel better and give them good perspective. But to um, get your confidence from actually who you are, mm -hmm. who you are as a person, and not just what you look like. Even if you're gorgeous, that shouldn't be where you get your confidence from. It's, mm -hmm. it's gotta be about who you are as a sister, as a friend, as a student, and, um, and be gentle with yourself. Love yourself mm -hmm. like you're your own best friend, That's like you're great. your own mother, you know? DJ Arrebenta. What impact would you guys like think this move is gonna have on teenagers and young women? Oh wow, I just hope that they come away from the movie really enjoying it, laughing a lot, and feeling really empowered and like they can accomplish anything that they want to accomplish. Yeah, and I think anyone can have that message. I, I mean, I, I think it, because the main character and characters are women, women will, will relate to it, but I think men can get something from this too. Nice. Yeah. So, uh, Amy said in an interview uh, that she wished this movie, she, she had watched this movie when she was growing up. Mm. Uh, how you guys were like when you're teenagers and do you think like having a movie like this when you're growing up would have changed something I was like a you? crazy confident teenager. <laughs> <laughs> this is, should be no surprise to anyone. <laughs> but I was like a crazy confident teenager. And I wasn't popular like in my school. I wasn't like a cheerleader popular girl. I just was like, I'm the best. I just really yeah. truly thought that I was going to move to LA and get a TV show and just be like on TV immediately and I kind of did and that. And you were. Yeah, and I, kind of, I really did kind of do that. I had so I had way more confidence as like a 17-year-old than I had as like 22. Wow. Yeah, I was just super confident. That's great. Yeah. I was the opposite. Yeah, I was mm -hmm. very shy. Um, I did perform. I was still on stage doing musicals and plays and choir and stuff, but uh, when I was around people normally, I, I didn't really know how to hold myself or be confident. I think, yeah, it would have been nice to, to see something that was empowering like this movie and, and inspiring in a way that would make me feel like I could do the same thing. Oh, that's great. Rory, this is such yeah. a feminist uh, movie. What do you think that guys can learn from this movie? Um, I hope that everybody kind of walks away realizing that, realizing that insecurities mm -hmm. uh, are spread out amongst everybody. It's a, it's a common thread. The, the insecurities are very different, but I think relatable to everybody. I, for one, hope that, I, I would like to believe that a lot of men see this movie and they already know where this is coming from. And they already know what this message is because this isn't the first time they've heard it. But if if they're not those people, then I, I hope a lot of men walk away going like, oh, I've now seen a the the, the visual perspective of what people have been telling me for a long time, and now either I'm going to accept it or not, and I hope they accept it and they figure out how to contribute to, you know, people feeling better about themselves. And Can you give longer answers? Yeah, <laughs> but, and that was, well, I'm not done Thank with this you. one. Who's that sexy thing I see over there? Vocês não me reconheceram, não é? That's me. Gente, sou eu. A Renée. Que isso? Ah... 
Ahodachi. Uh, I just want to like do like a little game. We cool. have every, we every time we have like some feminist content, cool. we get a lot of comments. Do no you? No misogynist Ooh. comments. Women, yes. like comments. women who like themselves. Or <laughs> comments. Yeah. Uh, fan feminism just wants to take women's opinion and personalities. Is there anything more oppressor than that? Wait, what's up? Yeah. <laughs> Didn't get that, that too. Was your, that was your Next. question. Well, I, I, I wrote that comment. Oh, that was your comment. Oh, okay. <laughs> feminist does not exist. It's just a word that feminists use to justify their BS. Okay, so these are obviously crazy people. Anyone that doesn't want equality for women is just scared of women. And I feel bad for them because we will get equality. So they need to just join us or we'll leave them in the dust. That's perfect. <laughs> thank you very much, thank guys. You. Enjoy your thank day. You.